مرحب مرحب يا رمضان يا بطارة ويا بالصيام ويا بالمصاحف ويا بالقرآن ويا شهر محمد عليك السلام ليالي سعودي وشهر الصيام علينا فعودي بأحسن مقام ولطفا وجودا وبالخير تام وأوف العهود لنا يا كرام يا شهر فيك الرضا والقبول ببك كل هم وغم يزول عسى وفق ساعة بجاه الرسول لقى ليلة القدر فيها سلام فيك البشاير وفيك الرضا من الله والعفو عما مضى رعى الله زمانا ووقتا مضى تعود علينا بخير التمام فيك التهجد وفيك القران وفيك التراويح يا رمضان عصى الله يصلح لنا كل شام بتوفيق من عند رب الانام سلام من الله عز وجل على المصطفى احمد عدد ما نزال حيا بارض وما شهر هل وما لاح بارق بمشرق وشام وما هب ريح وفلك جرى وما سار حادي لم القرى وما صام صايم وقاري قرى وما طاف بالبيت سبع التمام وصلي إلهي على المصطفى حبيب المشاهد وأهل الوفاء وأهل المودة we're really pleased to be here this evening, really pleased to be supporting this Afar. It's such a wonderful opportunity to bring the community together and for everyone to share during this very special month an opportunity to share a meal, to share some time with your neighbours, your friends, your family, and of course an opportunity to get to know one another better. I think that's the spirit of this Ramadan, that's the spirit of this Afar. And it's a spirit that I hope we can continue into the evening as we all make friends and break bread. Now, we've got a lot of speakers this evening and I want you to have an opportunity to hear from them all. I'm really, really looking forward to introducing you to them all. We're going to start off as we often do at these sorts of things, at these sorts of events, with a recitation from the Quran by Kari Isa al Inazi. And then we will hear a translation in English. So, over to you. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim الرحمن علم القرآن خلق الإنسان علمه البيان الشمس والقمر بحسبان والنجم والشجر يسجدان والسماء رفعها ووضع الميزان ألا تطغوا في الميزان وأقيموا الوزن بالقسط ولا تخسروا الميزان والأرض وضعها للأنام فيها فاكهة والنخل ذات الأكمام والحب ذو العصف والريحان فبأي آلاء ربكما تكذبان خلق الإنسان من صلصال كالفخار وخلق الجان من مارج من نار فبأي 
بِآيَاتِ رَبِّكُمَا تُكَذِّبَانِ رب المشرقين ورب المغربين فبأي آلاء ربكما تكذبان مرج البحرين يلتقيان بينهما برزخ لا يبغيان فبأي آلاء ربكما تكذبان يخرج منهما اللؤلؤ والمرجان فبأي آلاء تكذبان وله الجوار المنشآت في البحر كالأعلام فبأي آلاء ربكما تكذبان كل من عليها فان ويبقى وجه ربك ذو الجلال والإكرام صدق الله العظيم السلام عليكم The Sheikh read in chapter 55 Surah Rahman the first ayah the most compassionate taught the Quran created humanity and taught them speech. The sun and the moon travel with precision. The stars and the trees bow down in submission. And for, as, as for the sky, he raised it high and set the balance of justice so that you do not defraud the scales, weigh the justice and do not give short measure. He laid out the earth for all beings in it are fruit, palm trees with date stalks and grain with husks and aromatic plants. Then which of your laws will you humans both deny? He created mankind from sand and clay like pottery and created jinn from a smokeless flame of fire. Then which of your laws favors will you both deny? He is the Lord of the two east and the two wests then which of your Lord's favour will you both deny? He merges the two bodies of fresh and salt water, yet between them is a barrier they never cross. Then which of your Lord's favours will you both deny? Out of both waters come from pearls and coral, then which of your Lord's favours will you both deny? To him belong the ships with raised sails, sailing through the seas like mountains then which of your lord's favors will you both deny every being on earth is bound to perish only your lord full of majesty and honor will remain forever then which of your lord's favors will you both deny just a little hair for that sure we're going to lower the mic, I'm a little bit short. Thank you very much. Okay, it now gives me great pleasure to introduce Mohammed Kosba, who is the chairman of Finsbury Park Mosque, and who will also be reading out a message from the local MP, Jeremy Corbyn. Assalamu alaikum everyone, uh, peace be upon you all, brothers, sisters. First of all, I, on behalf of the three organizations, Finsbury Park Mosque, Muslim, Muslim Welfare House and Islamic Relief, I'd like to welcome you all. This is our fifth street of Tar, alhamdulillah. We started this after the terrorist attack which happened in Finsbury, Finsbury Park 
six years ago when our beloved Makrim Ali passed away and about 10, 11 people injured. We started this one in solidarity to the victims of this terrorist attack. And this one, we come every year here to celebrate our diversity, our unity, and to say that we are all together against those who try to divide us and spread hatred, fear, and division. So all are welcome today, and I hope that you, we share the iftar together, we share food together, and I hope you enjoy the food and the hospitality of our volunteers. Big thanks to them. They are the main heroes behind this event. I just want to mention that uh, Jeremy Corbyn, the local MP, our local MP, our local MP, he couldn't come this year. He's away, he's traveling, but he sent a message and he asked me to read the message to you as our own MP here in the Finsbury Park and Islington North. Hi everyone. Well done to Finsbury Park Mosque, Muslim Welfare House and Islamic Relief for putting such a wonderful event together. The Finsbury Park Street of Tar is an incredibly joyous yet reflective occasion marking a very significant time for Muslim communities around the world. This is a time for celebration, contemplation, and unity. What I love most about this day is that the Finsbury Park Street Iftar encouraged all communities to come and celebrate this precious moment together. I know this year has been an extraordinarily painful and difficult time for so many of you. Following the earthquakes, in Turkey and Syria. I wanted to commend the resilience you have shown and the support you have offered to those in need. Thank you for showcasing the power of harmony, harmony hope, and solidarity. Jeremy Corbyn. Thank you.